guys right now for all the wind. <laughs> There's nothing to stop it out here. But it's worth it. Marty, Lisa, and Tori, Marty's crew. Today, we're in some place we've been wanting to visit for a long time, ever since we first heard about it. Kansas' newest state park. Where are we? Little Jerusalem. Little Jerusalem. Little Jerusalem Badlands State Park. John Trail, it's a short one, but the site is gonna be worth it. So millions of years ago, Kansas was underneath a huge inland sea. For the years as that uh, sea evaporated and declined, it left deposits of sediment that eventually turned into these chalk formations. As the wind and the erosion takes it away, it's very fragile, so there's no climbing on it. Uh, it creates these awesome rock formations, rock chalk formations that you see here. We visited them before at Castle Rock and uh, also well known as Monument Rocks. But Little Jerusalem is the largest concentration of them. We've been waiting for a long time for them to uh, open this up to the public. It's been privately owned until recently. So thanks to the Nature Conservancy and the uh, Kansas Department of Wildlife uh, uh, for making it possible for us to visit. It's a sight worth seeing.
hope you enjoyed the visit to Little Jerusalem Badland State Park. We sure did. It was worth the four hour drive to get here. Um, we will be returning. Uh, if, you, if you come to visit and you want to get down off the trail a little bit, you can schedule a guided tour. Just make sure to call in advance. They're free. If you don't, and you do come to visit, remember to stay on the trail. Practice leave no trace principles. This is a very fragile ecosystem and uh, we want to preserve it.